train yard is on the north end of the Gulag. I'll wait for you there. On my way. Strange being in the field. Damn. Got to get out of here. A military patch for Trinity soldiers. Aside from the design, there's no identifying text. They keep themselves hidden, even from their own foot soldiers. As we push Things are becoming clear. I know there's something hidden here. 
The Soviets came looking for it too. And now Trinity and Anna. Anna. God. I still don't quite believe it. All this time. Did she watch Dad as well? I've got to keep moving. Find Jacob and join his people. If I can prove myself to them, maybe he will tell me more about this place. As we push deep Jacob 
Jacob? I think I'm close to the train yard. Are you there? A badge of rank in a military order. Trinity. Took you so long. I thought I lost you back there. Not a chance. Thanks for getting me out of that place. Let's move! We can get up through there! See? Drink this. It'll help. You could have left me in that river. Would you have left me? I'd have thought about it. <laughs> what makes you think I didn't? makes you risk so much to come here. The Divine Source. I know what you're looking for. But I want 
want to know why. When I was young, it was just my father and I. He was an archaeologist too. In his last years, he was obsessed with myths about immortality. Of course, no one believed him, including me. Our last conversation was a fight. He... he took his own life. I thought I'd come to terms with it, but... Something else happened. And I saw something that I thought was impossible. It changed everything. I realized my father was right. He died alone and broken. But he died for something. So you believe the Divine Source is real? I honestly don't know. But if there is any truth to it, I have to find out. It, it needs to be researched and studied. It could make a difference to the world. It's not something to be hidden away. A difference is not always for the best. Would you wish Trinity to have the secret to immortality? Of course not. Then I would ask you not to abandon your quest, but to alter its path. Join me and my people. Help us repel Constantine and Trinity. Then after that's done. And you leave our valley untouched. But knowing that you've done the right thing. No. I'm sorry. I can't do that. Can't. Or won't. I'll fight Trinity with you, but my goal remains the same. If I give up now... You'd feel like you'd be letting him down. Not just him. I need answers, Jacob. I need to understand. You're leaving. Right now, my concern is for my village. It's over the mountain pass. A day's journey on foot. But there may be a faster way through the old copper mine. You rest. I'll be back soon. like they set traps around the perimeter. I've got one casualty so far. Doing a sweep. Alone again. Jacob's gone ahead. There's something about him that I can't quite put my finger on. It's strange, but almost comforting. Like I could tell him anything, and it wouldn't faze him. I sense no judgment from him. At the same time, he's hard to read. My instincts tell me he's a good man. He saved my life. I think I can trust him. At least for now. Jacob, he told us to wait for you, but these bastards found us first. Uh, 
Oh God, are you all right? I'll live, but I need a safe place to rest in case the invaders return. There's a cave across the bridge over there, a wolf den. They won't look there, but I can't clear it out on my own. Not like this. If you could kill them, we'll have a safe place to regroup. I might even have something for that pistol of yours. Can you help us? Yes, of course. Stay out of sight. I'll be back. Thank you. Jacob was right about you. cave? Is it safe? The cave is clear. If you head there now, you'll be safe. Thank you. Here, take this. Jacob told us to protect you, but you weren't the one who needed it. 